What's up everybody? I'm back with another one for you today. This is my first ever just straight up vlog. Yeah, we'll see how this goes. Basically what I wanted to talk about with you today are demos versus reviews. A lot of people on the internet get this twisted. I know, people on the internet getting things twisted. Twist it. Imagine that. Now occasionally they can be blended together and sort of be in the same video, much like I did with the Squire Cyclone video yesterday. This is what actually got me thinking about this and realizing that I never talked about this on YouTube. I've talked about it on the podcast a lot, but I wanted to address it here and just get it out there for people. First off, a demo. A demo is just a product demo. It is just showing you what it is, maybe with a couple thoughts thrown in, but it's just showing you what it is, what I can make it sound like, and all that jazz. It's a little less of an opinion piece, and it's more of just like, here's the product, let's try to showcase it being the best thing that it can possibly be in the way that I know how to use it. A review is a little different. A review is much like what I did yesterday. Yes, I did demo some sounds, but I also gave my personal opinion on it. I was not paid for that opinion. I will never be paid for a review. A review is simply what I think about something. Paid reviews are weird. Do they exist? Maybe. I don't personally know any YouTubers or content creators that do paid reviews. Paid demos are different. That said, if I'm ever doing a demo that I'm being paid for, YouTube has a little box that you check and you will see it pop up on your screen that it is a paid promotion of some sort, so you'll know. Or, much like the sponsorships on the podcast, it will be a sponsored video and it will say sponsored if there is money exchanging hands. The demo slash review I did yesterday was not paid for outside of Fender sending that to me for a giveaway that is coming up, as a lot of you know. So I don't consider that to be paid or sponsored in any way, other than they're gonna be helping me help out a good cause. So it's kind of a different thing. You'll see how that shakes out pretty soon. All this to say is some people think a product demo is a review or a review is a demo, and that's not necessarily true, and I don't know of any other content creators that really work that way. If they're reviewing something, giving their honest opinion on it, that's a review. If they're paid to demonstrate the product for you, that is different. So all of that jibber jabber, just to say, you will know when I'm being paid on this channel if I ever get that opportunity. Just like on all the other media that I produce. So anyway, that was a vlog, I guess. I've never done that before. It's kind of weird just talking into the camera without another person to talk to. I'm a podcaster. I'm not used to doing this by myself. Anyway, thank you for watching. I hope this helped clarify some things for you. And if you have any questions for me, hit me up. I'm available. If you need more, need more content, need more content, content, hit me up at the Tone Mob on Instagram. Post some stuff there every day. Go to your favorite podcast app and download the Tone Mob podcast. There are 200 plus episodes out. I can't hardly believe that. But yes, there's a ton of content. And I'm also a co-host on Chasing Tone with Mr. Brian Wampler. Kind of don't care. So lots of tone mobbery to go around. You can join us in the Tone Mob Facebook group. That's enough plugging. You got other things to do. Let's go. Woo!